Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Enchanted Ways. I am Danielle, and this is the third installment in my series on magic geared towards newbies. We are discussing magical timing, and we are discussing, we are focusing on the days of the week. So picking up with where we left off, let's get into Thursday. Um, Thursday, I have been finding that I've been um, starting to work with more because I've been finding... Um, that I have a connection with Jupiter. So, um, little side note before we get into Thursday. Um, if you find that you are um, being drawn to a particular energy, a particular planet, deity, whatever, um, try doing workings of any kind um, on the day that uh, that particular deity or planet or whatever is associated with and just see, you know, what kind of success um, you have. I've been finding that I've been having great success working with that Jupiter energy. So <clears throat> Thursday, again, um, or as alluded to, if you will, Jupiter rules over Thursday. Colors associated with Thursday are blue, purple, and green. Deities um, associated with Thursday are Thor, Jupiter, and Juno. And intentions that you can focus on on Thursday are abundance, protection, prosperity, strength, wealth, healing. And I also would add um, justice, fairness, um, balance. So any kind of court case work, um, I have found, um, done on a Thursday is quite effective. And, um, we know Jupiter be, Jupiter to be, you know, the luck planet. So any kind of luck that you're trying to increase, if you feel like you're not a very lucky person, um, do things on a Thursday, see what happens. Um, abundance, we all know because Jupiter is so large and all of that. So money workings, um, any kind of money spell can be done on Thursday, you know, not just Friday because uh, we kind of associate Friday with payday, but people be getting their paychecks on Thursday too. So, <laughs> you know, don't discount Thursday for prosperity work um, and healing that's self-explanatory. So any kind of healing spell, um, you can do that on a Thursday during a waxing moon. Because keep in mind, you know, um, combining as many elements as possible sends a very clear signal and symbol to your subconscious mind and to the universe and to whatever um, deity it is that you are working with so you know combine different magical elements together in a way where it's like they're building on each other it's like you're concentrating your intent so that's it for Thursday you guys because Thursday is kind of uh self-explanatory um to me so stay tuned for more guys we are almost done with this particular facet of this installment because again there's more than just the days of the week to time your spells by and all of that is going to be included in this particular installment so stay tuned guys thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next video